Hello everybody, my name is Antswim, welcome back to Let's Play Hearts of Iron 4, Kaiser Reich has Canada, let us continue on from where we last left off. So, we took we took the entirety of the United Kingdom, they've capitulated to us, we set up the old government, uh, I kind of wanted to annex them, and I thought I pressed the button to annex them, but apparently the game had other, you know, thoughts in mind, so you know, they're, you know, they're kind of just their own country, with two armies. I don't know where they got those troops from, but they have them, so I guess that's okay. How are they going to help us out? I don't I don't think they are. They have no boats. Apparently they have a lot of planes. That's good. Eh, maybe? But right now we're playing an invasion of uh, Dunkirk. You know, nothing foreboding there. Uh, Northern Uranium deposits. Uh, anything else we can really do? We have radio detection. Okay, so we actually can't do this until we have to either research something else. Okay. Add technology, main as company one. Oh, this, this gives us technology. That, that maybe would have been useful to know. Defense keep one. This stuff's still completely... Like, none of these gives, like, factories, right? Land forts, land forts, land forts, land forts. Okay, that... None of this works. We can't support anybody because nobody's doing stuff. Yeah, so that this is kind of all worthless. Yeah, so just ignore that. Strength in the Navy, it just gives us free stuff. Uh, gives us a naval base, knockyards, Navy experience. You know what, might as well, 56 days. No biggie there. Assuming we actually have enough, we have enough supplies, right, to support these troops here? Wonderful. We actually have convoys. So, the problem with that is that it's hard for us to actually send troops over here. Because they eat so many convoys of ours. Which is pretty bad. Okay, you're actually here. I don't know why these are green already, but convoy raid here, here, and there, I guess? I want you to convoy, ra uh, convoy raid the exact same places. Okay, you guys. Convoy raid here, here, and here. Just make sure, just make sure the French don't have convoys. Is what I'm trying to get at. Okay, you're at a dock. Convoy raid here, here, and here. Um, okay, who else is docked? The Pacific Fleet. Oh yeah, you guys exist, right. Um, they still couldn't go over there, but actually we can just convoy raid... Here. And try to make sure these guys maybe don't get supplies? That's about the best we can really do. Because I kind of just forgot those ships even existed, honestly. Uh, India, we still can't really do anything. Are any of those guys major powers? Only France is actually major power. So France capitulates, the war's over. Because everybody else here will, like, just instantly capitulate. Which is a little bit weird, being as, you know, they are pretty big countries with a lot of troops. With, you know, pretty good secure on the, uh... I mean, India is actually winning, which is weird. I don't know how the hell they're doing that. How, how much more participation do we have? Like, we should 56%. I feel like, really, we should have, like, 110%, but I can't really argue with them. You guys are going to be ready in a few days. I just kind of wish we could see what was happening in, uh, in Germany right now. Because... Yeah, I mean, we, we could send troops, but I don't know how many German troops are actually here. I don't care about our popularity, that's fine. Like, uh, where? I mean, there's only, like, one battle happening. So I don't, I don't know what's happening. And actually, it looks like both Dunkirk and this other port are just... Oh, nope, there's some guys there. But he has very, very low organization. That is excellent for us. Excellent news. So hopefully that'll go out fine. I think we're just basically going to keep this manpower just in reserves. Make sure that, you know, people are actually reinforced. Oh, look. More of those troops are actually finally showing up. Wonderful. They show up just in time to not be useful. Naval combat. 32 ships against two convoys. I don't really need to hear about that, honestly. 
Like they have a decent amount of a decent they have a decent amount of convoys, but I think we need more planes, right? One plane a month? Fantastic. Well, you guys are just ready to go, so we're gonna basically go over here, try to land in these two provinces. But it is it, a port province, and that's really all that matters. What the hell is the Dutch going? Du are you in the war? You're not in the war, so I don't know what the hell you're doing. And as long if they can, how's it gonna take 57 days? I don't know. 30 days, 31 days, 25 days. You just, ha you just have to leave the city. Leave Dunkirk. 3, 2, 1. Oh, the French Vikings land over there as well. Fantastic. Just, just leave Dunkirk. Oh, is there, actually, is there planes there? It's got a question mark, so maybe. And leave. Thank you. Okay. The British, you guys need the front line here like immediately. Oh, they took back the other port. How much supplies do we actually have over here? Six out of 32. Front line here. Go do that. Maybe I should just put these guys in like two separate armies. Because you guys should really not go all the way over there thinking about it. Yeah, you just go garrison there. And if you can think about not exactly... I probably shouldn't have sent 15 guys over to Dunkirk. Thinking about it doesn't really make a lot of sense. No, but you guys really don't need to be over here. You could just kind of go back. There you go. You figured it out. I mean, you have a lot of morale. We're sending more and more troops in. But just try to get in the back off. Hopefully, once again, do we have supplies? 20 out of 36. As long as this isn't over, then I think we can kind of just hold out here almost indefinitely. Yeah, but just kind of keep pushing the French out. You know, the bad French. Not, not, not our French allies. The, you know, the bad, evil, communist French. I think we just overran somewhere, so that's good. We're already making we're already making great progress. The Canadians historically always do great here, so it's going great for us. They keep trying to attack us, but you know that it could be worse. I want you go down here, half you go here, you keep going this way as well. These guys should fall pretty pretty fast. So, purple, your objective is to take Paris. Do you like it, something like that? What's your problem? Division is still preparing or you're not in position. You know, that's not, really, that's not really a big concern of mine. You just kind of do this. Don't be, like, super aggressive. Just kind of be, you know, okay with it all. 27 out of 36. We can even send more of you. Split in half. Reinforce here. Just take city after city. Uh, we'll take some marines. Go to Ghent. Ghent isn't a French province. It is a Belgian province. But it is going to go to national France. So I guess it's fine. We might as well take this other city if we're in the neighborhood. Okay, no, we got more French. We got some more uh, troops of ours showing up. Oh, commune of France. Commune of France. Got a lot of troops, and I'm pretty sure they probably have a lot of troops over in Germany. Because, like, Communist Germany has two brigades. So, it's, it has to be, like, entirely French troops making up this offensive over here. So, you know, where we are, we can already go march on the Paris. I feel like it's pretty good for us. 25%? So, look at, like, 
pretty easily as well, so that's good. Yeah, just keep on pushing through. I guess this guy- is that guy in this province? I don't know where he is. How these French advance this way, or these uh, tanks advance that way. If you guys can kind of just push into this province, that would be great. Now the Marines don't really know what to do. Now we're at 65. As long as we can have like a 100% war contribution, contribution, then it should all be fine. Uh, what's actually going on with like your actual war? You have 49%, which is, th like, 300 points? Our point to total is actually less than that, which is weird. I don't know how it could be less than that. We, we 200,000 Canadians have died. That's, that's quite a significant number of Canadians. I don't know how many Canadians died in actual World War II. I can't really recall off the top of my head, but... It definitely wasn't the number we've taken now, I'm pretty sure. Let's take Brussels. Auto saving. Send more troops. Who the hell are you? Oh, you're <laughs> the British have shown up. Wonderful. Where's the new capital? The new capital of France is for No, it's over here in Bre it's over here in Brittany? Why would it be in Brittany? Seems like a weird choice, but okay. The, the Indians think they can take 20% work tribulation just because they declared two stupid wars on their own subcontinent. They're taking all our points away. We should be at like 90%. But we're not. That is silly. Uh, we could probably send even more troops than the last guys over. Because right now supplies are perfectly okay. We're about to make our objectives very, very soon. Are you actually advancing into the province? No. These guys have really low organization, so I don't know what this problem is. Let's go you take that province. Uh, perp, I guess pink doesn't really have an objective either. Pink, you just gotta go take, like, take Luxembourg and hold on to that. Uh, your front line, edit the front line. You shouldn't be all, it doesn't, why does it do a loop-de-loop? -loop? Like, your front line should just be here. And then you do that. Try to take Luxembourg. I mean, there's not really no benefit of having Luxembourg because it's Luxembourg. But you know, strengthen the navy, fantastic. We have low we have low resources because we have those extra things. Battleships, more naval dockyards, sure. Why not? Uh, trade. What do we need? We need steel, I think. Yeah, we need a little bit of steel. So we'll get that from the United States. I think that's fine. Are you planning on ever like joining the war effort? Like, they have to prepare for a war, but I don't think the United States is ever going to get involved. Oh, we actually have some German troops. Wonderful. They've decided to show up. Hey, Netherlands, you want to join our faction? No. Hey, Italy, you want to join our faction? No. I still haven't even thought about that. Um, how many points does Italy have? Because they're also going to get invited to the stupid peace conference. They have points as well. 600,000. Oh, how is France even alive? Like, they have uh, 600,000. They have 700,000. Another 550. And then another 7,300. That's like 2 million men dead. For the French. That was, those are st staggering numbers. Uh, Yeah, sure. More power. I mean, now we have points. It won't, it won't send us into the negative. So I think I'm fine. Clicking on that decision. Is that Germany? No, the United Baltic Duchy have decided to join in. Wonderful. You guys just keep on pushing. I think they're trying to still do their first objective, but... Delete the first objective. Let's go after the new objective. All of you over here. And try to push there. We'll take Liège soon, but I don't think these I don't think these cities actually count towards our uh, our victory. Because these are technically Flemish 
cities. So I don't think we get any like benefit from taking them, but very high, fantastic. The people love us. 85% people support our, our government. And that is nice. Oh, the uh, the Caribbean Federation decided to join it over here. I don't know why, but they did. You know, we have a you know, we have a foothold already in France. We already have Paris. You can just land there. But apparently uh apparently they don't agree with me. Is there anything else we can do with Anything else we can do with the Marines? They probably want to be. They probably can do better things and advance this way, right? I mean, they are pushing their way through, and that is nice. Are you even? The, are you even the right? Okay, no, you're part of the right army. Let's just get Luxembourg to capitulate just because they'll capitulate because they only have one province, right? They'll just capitulate instantly. And Luxembourg has capitulated at midnight. Oh, Luxembourg. Is this one province? It is one province. If we can just send like one marine over here, then we can kind of cut all these guys off from supplies. Making that job a lot easier. Oh, the French have actually shown up as well. Thanks, France. I think those are like garrison units, so they're basically like a police force that they just decided to, you know, use. Don't know why. 46%. Yeah, but pushing this way really doesn't help us at all. We want to push this way. Oh, they actually did take Brest. Okay, now the new capital is Bordeaux. Yeah, 40%. Do you think the Caribbean Federation can actually hold on to that province? I have my doubts, but you know. How about you just be very aggressive in this advance now? We need, to, we need to try to end this war as soon as possible. Yeah, France, you're losing too many men. 40,000 at last. How, many, how about like this like last month? We fought, we've 98% win victory. 91%. We're the world's greatest country. We, we do not lose. We don't know that we don't know the meaning of the word defeat. We're about to meet we're about to meet up with our Caribbean friends. Stop attacking, go meet up with them. Cut these guys out from supplies. And let's take these next two cities. Cut off these guys from supplies. Oh, this is actually going to Germany, which I, I guess kind of makes sense, but still. Carlos Spain was annexed. Communist Spain is doing quite well in the Civil War, which is bad for us because we might have to go to war with Spain as well. But actually, no, we'll have to. France will capitulate before we have to do anything with Spain. So never mind, actually. It, it'll work out just, just fine for us. And how close are you to capitulating, France? 39%. You're getting there. We'll get another city. So the entirety of northern France has been liberated. Absolutely wonderful. You're only you only have to take one more province, Marines. Uh, after that, I don't know. I don't know really what you guys can even do. Like, what's Germany been doing? Have they they have like 120 divisions? I have no clue where the hell they are. Like, we have how many men? Like, we have 84. Like, we don't even have a lot of divi like divisions, but. Without a shadow of a doubt, we're just completely ruining the French. Let's go kill this guy just because we can. I mean, this won't cut anybody off from supplies just because, you know, they're connected to uh, Germany over here. Actually, I don't think it would, right? I doubt it. They're at 25, just like one more city. Where the hell are you going? Just like one more city, and that should be the end of the Second World War. The Second Wild Creek. France has capitulated. They're currently fighting alone, and will send her as soon as they capitulated. They're fighting alone. Oh, are they not going to, uh... 
I thought the war would just end as soon as we won, but apparently not. Also, the French Republic... We just have control of, like, southern France. Outdated... Oh, we're... Yeah, make better, uh... Machine guns and stuff. It'll take a while for that to work out, but that's fine. And... The French Republic... You can just kind of have all of, you know, France. Because I don't want it. And I think that should have been, like, all... There's some, some territories left that we can't really do anything about. Yeah, but there we go. Uh, they've surrendered. So we do have to fight everybody else, even though there's no great powers left. On their side. Okay, well... Frontline here. Delete whatever the hell this is. Uh, Marines, you're just going to garrison basically like right here. And just basically prepare to like take the southern half of Bavaria. Cause I oh no, there we go! Okay, so... Take all states. Does Delhi have claims on this stuff? I'm not even too sure what the hell Delhi has. Take all states. Is there anything we can, like, release? Take all states. Luxembourg, take all states. Liberate Bavaria, Prussia, Rhineland. Well, look, how many points? We have 500 points. Germany has a lot of points. Liberate Bavaria. Take all states. Oh, I'm in the commune of France. I mean, we'll take as much as we can. And then we'll probably just give it to, like, actual France. Germany's going to take Luxembourg. Because it's just all take states. There's really nothing left. They're going to take Brandenburg. Yeah, just kind of keep taking provinces. They're uh, taking Western Alps. So Italy's expanding a little bit. I like how this province is just called Center. Let's take Paris. Apparently we have like all the points, so... We can't even take that. I guess we'll take Center. Can we take anything other than Center? Yeah, so Germany's taking back most of their territory. Oh, and then Germany annexed the entirety of Southern France. Um, okay. Why can't we take all states? I mean, I'll click on as much of this as I can. Don't know why it says we can't click take all states when clearly by pressing these buttons, we're taking every single state here. Yeah, I guess we'll... We're done that. But, uh... Manage occupy territory. Release nation. France. Does the French Republic not have claims over here? They do. Why can't I return territory to France? Return territory. We can return territory to Denmark, Iceland, Commune of France, regular France, Duchy of Normandy. Like, do you not have claims here as well? They have a claim. Oh, because they don't have cores? It doesn't count? I wonder if... Okay, what we're going to try is we're going to try to... Uh, well, first, I'm going to save. Just so we can go back to this. It's going to be a little bit of a longer episode, but, you know, bear with me. If I release France... Why are they gray? I don't know. Will there be, like, an event to annex them together? Spain's capitulated. But they're still at war. Oh, yeah, they're at war with Germany still, right. But they did just annex, like, the entirety of France. 
the Ottoman Empire has ended their war. Well... They won't even join our fact. Well, what, what do you mean they won't join? Let me, let me let's me let go back. Let's load this up. What do you mean they won't join our faction? That's absurd. And I, it's like I can't give them territory. They, they, we can't give control of states. I mean, we can just release them as like puppets. Yeah, release as puppet. There we go. They're a puppet of our country. They're in the Entente. Uh, let's just release the other stuff. Is it still called the, uh... British Bangladesh? Well, let's release all those guys as puppets. Because why not? Uh, Denmark, uh, you guys don't deserve to have Iceland and Greenland, honestly. It's it's now it's now ours forever and always. France. I don't know. You just kind of are here. Like are they core provinces of France here? Yeah, core state, but the French Republic only has a claim. And that's dumb. Hmm. But I was gonna be end this episode for now. Thanks everybody for watching. My name is Anthony. If you enjoyed, remember to thumbs up. If not enjoy, can always down. Wanna see more subscribe? And goodbye.